Welcome back to my channel guys. My today's video, I will gonna show you how to use the RFID RC522 with 1.3 OLED LED display and Arduino Uno module. Before we start, these are the list of materials that we needed. First, we have 1.3 OLED LCD display, RFID RC522 scanner, Arduino Uno module, assorted color, mail to mail jumper wire and lastly the Arduino Uno connector let us now set up the circuit first let us connect the ground pin and the positive 5 volts And let us connect the ground of 1.3 OLED LCD and the positive 5 volt or BCC to positive and connect the ground pin of RF IDRC522 to the ground next is the positive 3.3 volts to pin 3.3 volts Next, using yellow jumper wire, we connect the SCL to pin A5 and green jumper wire to SDA to pin A4. Next is using orange jumper wire, we connect the reset pin of RFID RC522 scanner to pin number 9. Next is the MISO pin. MISO pin. to pin number 12 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 next using the violet jumper wire we connect the mossy pin to pin number 11 Using the green jumper wire, we connect the SCK or clock to pin number 13. Then lastly, using the yellow jumper wire, we connect the STA to pin number 10. After we set up the connect connection, let us now connect this to Arduino Uno module. And this connected to our laptop or computer. After we connect the Arduino Uno connector to our laptop or computer, let us now open the 
Arduino IDE or Integrated Development Environment to create a program to our circuit. Next, go to file. Let us open the program I created for RC522 scanner with 1.3 OLED LCD. On the top of my program, we include all the libraries we needed for RC522 and UHG2 library for the 1.3 OLED LCD. We define all the uh, pin number and the interrupt we use the constructor for UHG2 1.3 OLED LCD we have a instance for RC522 we declare byte and UPICC for for number of array inside the void setup we declare serial begin for serial monitoring baud rate we have UHG2 begin we have G to enable for 1.3 OLED LCD. We have SPI begin for SPI bus and init for MFRC522. We have for loop to read the card in hexadecimal. Then we disable the serial print LN okay, for the for serial monitoring. Then inside the void loop. We have a UHG2 display 1.3 OLED LCD. Please scan your RFID. Then we have a reset loop if the new card present on the sensor reader. If RFID is not equal to new card present, then return. Then if not RFID based read card serial, then return. Then serial print LN PICC type. MF, uh, MFRC522 for uh, getting the serial number of our of the tag and card then if the tag or ID is not a MIPER type we have a display in our 1.3 OLED LCD said access denied okay if the RFID is equal to the the card, okay, we display access granted in 1.3 OLED LCD. Next, else if the card scan twice, the card read previously display on 1.3 OLED. LCD then we have RP PICC Alt A then stop encryption then we disable the function in displaying the card ID in hexadecimal and the card ID in decimal format okay let us try this uh, program first let us verify the code if there is encountered an error Okay, done compiling. The program encountered no error. Then we can now upload the program in Arduino Uno module. Before that, let us check first the uh, board if properly selected and the port if pro properly selected. Then let us now upload this program in Arduino Uno. Okay, done uploading. Let us try now the circuit. Let us try the RFID tag first. Okay, access granted. Then the RFID card. Access granted. Then let us try the other card. Access denied. Okay, let us try to scan Okay, 
twice the uh, rep tag. Okay guys, if you learned to my video, uh, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and push the notification button for some updates. And thank you for watching.